Hey, if you're, quote, not a cat person, you can go fluff yourself. But he was one time, a non-cat person came over into my house and immediately started sneezing. Achoo! Achoo! Then she said to my human, oh, you have a cat in here. Oh, dear, a dirty cat. Achoo! She didn't even cover her nose. Just sprayed that snot all over the wall. Ew. She was looking at me like I was the problem. Guess what, lady? I've taken 17 baths today. How many have you taken? One. Pfft. So you know what I did? I rubbed all over her. And then she sneezed, sneezed, sneezed. Wine, wine, wine. Human, human, human. It was great. Then, after she sneezed about 14 more times, all over my scratching post, spraying that human nose juice all over my blankie. She had the nerve to ask, can you put the cat outside? What the fluff? I live here, troll. You're the visitor, not me. I've spent months getting this place all catted up. You can go live in a garbage can like Oscar the Grouch as far as I'm concerned, except I might feel bad for the garbage. You can go sit in a sewer and become a Teenage Mutant Ninja human. Oh, wait. You're way too old to be a teenager. I am an indoor cat. My paws do not touch sidewalks and street gutters, AKA your domain. Indoor cats are healthier, live longer, and are way less susceptible to injuries and diseases. And speaking of diseases, you need to leave my domain right now because you're making me sick. I'm allergic to you. Achoo, achoo, achoo. And my human wonders why I hide when strangers come over. Tell me what you think about non-cat people in the comments below. Ugh, I feel filthy just talking about that sneeze factory. I'm going to go give myself another bath. You stay fluffy, San Diego. And remember, cover your giant human nose when you sneeze. For the love of all things fluffy.